Are you deceiving yourself without even knowing it? This week, we're off balance on purpose, facing the facts. What are you pretending not to know? What do you claim is true that really isn't? What are you working on that you'll probably never finish and really don't want to? We all engage in acts of self-protection, insisting some things that just aren't so. This instinct is designed to shield us from the unpleasant or even painful. But when self-protection becomes delusion, you're probably not fooling anyone but yourself and you may just be forestalling the inevitable. Let's look at three particular types of self-deception, the first of which is the never-ending project. You know that big job that you started but just can't seem to get back to? You're gonna handle it one of these days when you can find the time and everything calms down, or the fact may be that you've stalled out, hit a roadblock, lost interest, or never even really wanted to do it in the first place. So let's decide. Schedule the time to knock it out, or release the obligation and the guilt that goes with it. Secondly, what patterns of present action are ineffective or truly harmful? Are you engaged in relationships, dialogues, habits, or behaviors that are taking an increasingly steep toll on you? Past experience and evidence makes it clear this isn't working and will only worsen over time. Change the pattern boldly. Demand more for yourself and from yourself. And number three, what do you believe that is just plain wrong? If you commit to the wrong strategy, it won't work no matter how well you execute. So stop throwing good money and valuable time and energy into fruitless pursuits. Tremendous freedom and great opportunity await you, but you can't say yes to what works without saying goodbye to what doesn't. So face the facts, have courage, and act with honesty. Until next week, stay off balance on purpose.